Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be building a teeny tiny little dorm room. I have uploaded this to the gallery so you can put it into whatever house that you would like. Um, it's three by three so it's super dinky so it can fit in basically anybody's home. So if you have a teen girly girl this could work for their bedroom maybe even if you're doing the 100 baby challenge because I know it's always really difficult to try and fit all those children in a small space um, I'm not entirely sure how much this came out how much this came out to be I think it was quite a bit but um, I was just really inspired by Cyberdoll. she makes amazing videos I think she just hit either six or seven thousand um, subscribers she is amazing she deserves way more than that so I will link her down below so what I've done is I've taken a white wardrobe and then I've uh, used the move objects cheat to elevate the bed and put it into the wardrobe just a little bit so that it looks like it's a loft bed like you have in a lot of dorm rooms um, and here I'm trying to like mess around with what I can put under the bed without it um, stopping this sim right here from getting in. So this has been play tested. Everything should work just fine. Um, I put a little uh, TV and a computer on the desk because I thought that would be super nice. Just this girl is a super girly girl. She's uh, she really likes watching YouTube videos on her computer and she likes watching like Real house Housewives of Beverly Hills and just like trash TV. No offense if you really like that kind of stuff. I like some of that stuff too. But yeah, so I went with a kind of like pastel pink and white theme for her room. Um, here I'm just trying to like get something to fit all together. Um, I didn't realize at the very beginning that I had some of the items sticking out of the walls so I had to go back and fix that but yeah so um, this time I went and here in a second you'll see me open up the debug menu I've never really used the debug menu but I've been seeing a lot of different youtubers use it and I thought it'd be a really cute idea to make her a little like a little bar area um, and I know these are snowflakes and we're getting into the middle of summer at least in the US but I thought that was really cute because they're like they light up but yeah so she's super glamorous a lot of this stuff does come from city living and also from oh my goodness what's it called uh, it's not luxury party it's Vintage Glamour, Vintage Glamour. So like the flower pot there is from Vintage Glamour and everything. But at first I was going to use this little drinks tray from Spa Day, but then I came up with this idea to use the debug menu and put some like wine glasses and things around. So yeah, I don't know. Have you guys ever lived in a dorm? I have never actually lived in a dorm room. My old roommate used to live in a dorm and I used to visit her before we moved into our apartment together. Um, I personally first moved out from my parents house and went to a community college so I had to get an apartment or live with them so I ended up getting an apartment and moving out when I was 18. So I never actually uh, lived in a dorm room but I think this would be a really cute way of doing it. Um, I was thinking about doing a dorm build with two bedrooms because I know typically at least in America you do have two people per room but I really like the fact that I could personalize it to just the individual. I do think I'm going to make a sim for this room. The one that you see me testing everything with is just literally a random character I created to be able to make sure it was play tested and play approved but yeah so now I'm pulling out some of the stuff from the debug menu like I was talking about so some of the um, 
makeup and things from Vintage Glamour and I was thinking about making like a little bench type area for makeup in front of her mirror so she could like set all her things down but in the end that didn't work out so I just put the makeup on the desk like she had just kind of thrown it back down after she used it because she was in a rush to get to class or something. I know I've definitely done that. My bathroom is a bit of a tip right now. On a, I think we're getting close to the end here, just the finishing touches and everything. So I'm going to start the music for the screenshots and thank you guys so much for watching and I hope you did enjoy. Please like and subscribe if you did.